So it was an incredible night. To be honest with you, we didn't know what to expect. Uh, last night was really small, church, very intimate, very hot, and uh, you know, just just off of a side street, kind of a nowhere place. See, what Mark did tell you was, for him it took 14 times to say that prayer. And for Dina, she prayed, but she only gave 90% of it. She didn't give all of it. She gave 10% back. But tonight, if you said that prayer, you're hard connected with God. And you're telling me tonight that you're giving one of the first day off in a while. And we're cruising for the first time in a jeepney. And I gotta tell you, these are made for shorter people. Because <laughs> I'm too short. Now, Aziz is doing just fine. What's for dinner tonight, Jabby? I think we're gonna have some chicken. <laughs> Today we're taking a tour through the public market. This is Jack. Driving to the gig in major flooding. it all was this doubt I doubted deep down in my heart if there was a God I doubted if what my youth pastor was teaching me was real but I still went and what happened was I became a two-faced person on Sunday I'd come to church and on Friday and Saturday I'd live like the world. I started partying, I started drinking, I started doing drugs, and it was just an empty life. I was trying to fill a void that was inside of me, and I came up, came up empty every time. And this was the underlying cause of it all, doubt. And not until I went to a Salvation Army camp on the north shore of Hawaii, something happened. Something happened that, that changed my life. God spoke to me. And he showed up. And he told me three words. The three words that changed the direction that I was heading. Three words that changed the course of my life. And those three words were, I love you. With those three words, he erased all doubt. He took it away. God's greater than my doubt. Amen. And so what happened was I, I started to want to know this God who loved me. And I started a relationship. It turned the religion that I was doing into something real. It turned the ritual into a real relationship with the real God, the God who spoke to me. I started hearing his voice by reading his word, and he started transforming my life. He started taking the desires to do drugs, he started taking the desires to drink and party, 
and he took it out from me, and he made me a new creation. He made me new, and he wants to do the same for you. You see, if you're here tonight, it's no accident that you're here. It's no accident that you found your, yourself in these seats and standing in this room. You are here because the God of this universe brought you here. And He wants to tell you three words. That He loves you. The God of this universe loves you. And you are here for that very reason. Amen? Help me to follow you. All the days of my life. Well, the concert was absolutely incredible tonight. Our last show in Ilo Ilo, 287 people saved.